taking you through a typical day as a work from home dermatologist, mom, and content creator. In the mornings, I always start off with my skincare routine. There's my Beauty of Chosan sunscreen. You always want to use two finger lengths. That's enough for your face and your neck. And don't forget to rub the excess on your hands. Today, I got really ambitious with the foundation that I was using. So apologies if I'm a little bit yellow or orange. Then I do the rest of my makeup routine. I actually didn't really wear makeup growing up and I'm getting way more into it because of TikTok. They're making me buy all of these unnecessary cosmetic products, put on my rings and ready to go. I always make my bed first thing in the morning because this just helps to start off my day on a good foot and I like getting into a clean bed at night. Now that that's done, let's go downstairs. My house is always somewhat of a mess because my son just likes to leave his toys everywhere and I mean everywhere. First things first, make myself some coffee and then also get some for hubby who has been in meetings since 7.30 a.m. Let's go deliver this to him and say hello. This is his office. It is a work in progress. Most of those frames are empty. Next, let's make some breakfast for myself. Today's just gonna be a simple day with some yogurt yeah, and almond butter energy. granola from Trader Joe's, my favorite. If any of you are wondering where my son is, my in-laws are staying with us these few weeks and they are amazing at getting him ready in the morning and taking him to school. I head up to the third floor, which is my home office <laughs> slash gym slash rec area, and I get ready to see my patients. One of the benefits of having my own practice is I can review their questionnaires beforehand, so I'm really prepared when they come in. Three hours later, my son comes home from school, and the first thing he always does is run up to the third floor and start messing with all the things on my bookshelf. I love being able to see him in between work meetings, and here we are getting him ready to go downstairs to eat some lunch. He loves piggyback rides lately. It is a lot of floors to go down. <laughs> Today, he's having bagels with cream cheese, his favorite. As he's eating lunch with the nanny, I quickly try to run away and go back up to the third floor. I am still eating my breakfast from this morning, so I guess it's lunch at this point. I have a couple more patients to see, so I am reviewing their charts and also getting ready to call their prescriptions in and make sure everything is all set. I finally get hungry for my lunner, I guess, at this point. And don't judge me, I was craving some instant ramen. Meanwhile, our nanny is making us some seaweed soup for dinner, and I am making myself some instant ramen. Now I move to the kitchen to finish up the rest of my work. I'm looking at contracts, reading through emails. One of the things I love about my current career is the great variety that comes every day, probably tackling my inbox at this point. And now to tackle this growing recycling bin. Then I move back upstairs to finish up on some content creation. This is a YouTube video draft on Miss Selena Gomez's skincare routine. Hubby is finally done with work, so we're getting ready to go out for a date night. He hasn't been out all day, so I really wanna take him out and do something special. We're trying Cafe Spinazzi in Seattle today in Capitol Hill, and it was delicious. My amazing in-laws put Totori to bed while we were out, so I come in to give him a kiss and look at how he's sleeping. Doing my PM skincare routine is always a very relaxing part of the day for me, especially taking off my makeup with a cleansing balm. I love how it feels and smells, and I give myself a nice little massage. Then I do my retinoid and then put on my Tatcha Indigo Overnight Repair, finish that off, off, rub it in, get ready for bed, and do a little bit of reading. Bye!